today we're gonna do the strip down challenge which you guys have been requesting me to do a super duper ton via Facebook comments so I looked it up and I saw what it was and basically you just set a timer for 10 minutes and then you just talk so it's basically like a tea vlog with a time limit and no editing. That's the other catch. I don't know if I said that already. Mine's gonna be slightly longer than 10 minutes because I'm a rule break, break, breaker. See, that's the problem with not editing videos is that when you say rule breaker, you suck with it. Uh, so I have set my timer for 10 minutes and it just looks like a big giant white screen right now. So the challenge officially begins right now. Uh, I thought that this would be a good week to catch up with you guys and do a tea vlog sort of thing. Actually, I'm so happy that I don't have to edit this video. Editing is my least favorite part of the entire process. Oftentimes I have wished and considered if I could find anyone in the world uh, to edit my videos. I wish I could do like more fun editing and basically anything beyond iMovie, like basic iMovie. I'm using janky iMovie, okay? I refuse to even update to the latest version of iMovie because I basically have no time in my life to stop and pause and learn anything new. But I don't know, I feel like maybe it would lose something. It would lose like an element of my videos. I'm also horrified by change. Um, so I don't know, that's kind of why I haven't really approached getting an editor. But I wish I could do like more like fancy stuff and I just can't, I can't learn, I can't do it. I probably could do it, but I now wish, now that I'm doing this, I wish that I could like travel back in time and like take college courses or something that are more computer related so that I could maybe have learned skills that I would realistically need in life instead of skills that I don't ever need in life. But that's kind of the thing about the school system, you know, like I feel like especially like in the United States and, and especially my experience, you know, uh, but with standardized testing, I feel like you lose, like, I don't know, we don't, I feel like we didn't learn any life skills. Like I feel like, especially now with the age of the internet, like we used to always complain and be like, oh, they don't teach us how to balance a checkbook or like any practical life skills in school. But now that there's a whole like technological element deeply embedded in our lives like why is there not more like we had a typing class <laughs> like how silly is that uh this day and age do they even still do that i don't know i just feel like there should be like more technological training we're already down to like seven minutes i feel like this is going by so fast and so slow this is like a stream of consciousness uh just like how i used to write my poems i was an english major that was what my degree was in, was creative writing with a focus on poetry. Fun fact, I also live in Texas, just in case you guys don't know that yet somehow, but I meet a lot of you guys out and about uh, locally and so many times everybody's like, I didn't know you lived in Texas. I didn't know you lived here. And I'm like, oh my gosh, how could nobody not know that about me? I feel like I literally have the state of Texas stamped on my forehead, but maybe I'm like, I'm not Texan enough, I guess. I'm not, I'm not getting the message out there. Not like that's an important thing, but I don't know. I feel like Texas is one of those states. I feel like it's like California. Like, I feel like we are sort of like a prideful state. We're like, I'm from Texas. It's just like a, it's like a, it's like, hi, my name's Bunny and I'm from Texas. That's like what the whole introductory statement could be. But I don't know, you guys, I miss doing tea vlogs. But in the same breath, I also feel like maybe it's boring to you guys. I feel like overall, they are some of my least watched videos or like least cared about videos and I don't know you guys it's like a conflict how many times have I said I don't know you guys this is the problem with not editing but I feel like I don't know sometimes it's like I wish I could just do more like stuff like this but I'm also just always compelled to give you guys what you like watching the most and when other videos get so many more views than other videos, I kind of just feel like, you know, like maybe I shouldn't make as many of the lesser watched videos, if that makes any sense. I need a sippy sippy break. <sighs> Let me know down below if you guys miss 
just chit-chatting, nonsensical, tea vlogging. Maybe this is something new we can do, like a new format where I just give myself exactly 10 minutes so it doesn't turn into like a giant 20 minute rambling thing um, and I just don't edit them. Would that, that, that could be kind of cool? I don't know. Uh, so yeah, I've had like a major panic attack over the weekend and into this week, so that has been fun. Not at all. I actually like went to the doctor. I was just like not feeling well for days on end. And if you guys have been here and watched some of my older tea vlogs, my anxiety uh, is very triggered by medical things. Like if I start not feeling well, even if it's something minor, I just whoo like it manifests into some horrible beast in my head and then i'm like oh my god i'm dying like and i can make fun of it because i use humor as a tool for myself like i use humor to help me get through difficult things so once i'm out in the clear and once i've like gotten through a situation i can be like bunny you are so dumb, for real. Uh, but, I mean, I'm not belittling anyone's anxiety. I feel like I'm allowed to make fun of myself, you know? So I can look back on myself and laugh at myself and be like, you need to take a breather, you need to get a grip. Uh, but I did end up going to the doctor and they sucked blood out of my arm and I'm all bruisey and sore and I had an x-ray and the whole nine yards. Uh, but the good news is I got all of my test results and stuff back and I'm in the clear. I'm not like infectious. I'm not having any sort of problems. So that made me calm down a lot. So I feel like today has been like, I, I finally got all the results back today and I'm like, oh, yay, great, good. Uh, I just was not feeling well in my stomach and that's like the worst to me. That's like my least favorite way to feel bad. It's not like, I'm like, oh yeah, stubbed your toe. That's a great way to feel pain. But like, particularly, I don't like when I'm like nauseous or sick to my stomach or sore throat is my second least favorite. Anybody else feel me on that? Uh, but I don't know, over the weekend it was really bad. That's why there was no video up this weekend and I'm sorry for that. Uh, I really, I have some does this thing really works and I need to get them in the works. Uh, but I was literally just crying in bed, sleeping all day. Uh, Dogman put on some funny television shows for me to watch. I'm not sure if this is like a controversial show. I'm not sure if this is like frowned upon, but I love anything with Carl Pilkington. P Pilkington? I think that's how you say his last name. Uh, he did An Idiot Abroad. He also does his own show called Moaning of Life. Um, but I really like watching his stuff. And over the weekend, Dogman found there was actually like I untold amounts of footage where he's like a little cartoon character. It's like Ricky Gervais and Gervais and Steven Merchant, but we found them all on YouTube actually. And there's videos where it's just a 10 hour block of video. So that was really good and really distracting and just nice of course to have Dogman there and be so supportive and everything. But I don't know, it was not, it was not a fun moment. I have not had a panic attack that bad in probably at least a year, but like when it hits me hard, it hits me hard and then it's like, oh, just not, not a good time. Um, so yeah, I don't know. Uh, I hope you guys have been liking the back to school giveaway. I uploaded that a couple days ago. How am I running out of stuff? We still have two minutes. I literally can't even talk for 10 minutes straight. It's a sign I'm a boring person, I guess. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. I feel like I feel like, what else do I feel? I feel like the air. Now it's just gonna be a minute of silence. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. You guys have got to tell me uh, down below, you know, leave me some requests. Now I'm just down to the asking for request part. Um, I feel like I've got a lot of products coming up for First Impression Friday. So many, in fact, that I wish that I could upload like two videos in a day, but I feel like that's a little bit much. I feel like that doesn't give anybody, I feel like maybe almost I am bombarding you guys with daily videos. I used to make daily videos, I feel very frequently, and I've kind of fallen off the bandwagon here in July, but I almost had daily videos in June. I was really proud of myself, uh, but I almost in some ways feel like maybe that is just like too much videos. 
I also often have been contemplating making a strictly, oh, now I'm gonna burp. That is really, can't edit that out, bunny. Um, I have also been contemplating making a strictly toy unboxing channel because that, the action of unboxing these little figurines, Dogman and I unboxed these the other day. I cannot wait to show you guys this video, but just the act of doing that and unboxing something silly is such a stress reliever for me. I wish I had an excuse to do it every single day or not an excuse, but it's just kind of like if I'm doing something fun, I'm doing something interesting. I like to share it with you guys because I really do truthfully feel like you guys are my friends and I don't know, I've always been so tempted to like do daily vlogs every now and again, or just, it's like if I'm doing something fun and interesting in my day, it's like I like to share it with you guys. But also I feel like maybe I'm just, oh, timer done, time to stop. I don't know, I also feel like sometimes I just bombard you guys with my face all the time. So that was 10 minutes. Uh, maybe I'm missing something to this strip down challenge. I don't know, I saw some people were like getting into like some really deep personal things or like, I don't know, maybe, I, maybe I'm maybe i doing it wrong. Maybe I should tell you guys like a particular story time story. I don't know. Uh, I'm now breaking the rules again. I'm a loner, Dottie, a rebel. Uh, so I don't know, leave me comments down below. Let me know if you guys like this format for doing tea vlogs, then maybe it wouldn't be a challenge. It would just be a normal thing that we do or if you guys would prefer for me to actually work and edit things. Uh, if you guys miss tea vlogs, let me know all the things that we discussed. Uh, thank you guys so, so much for hanging out and for watching today. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye!